Treasury Gardens, Friday. Last Friday in the evening, cops came and we defended a tarp and eight of us were arrested. Today, we served a bunch of notices and council have said they're going to come at 1.30, which is not that far away, because they want to disrupt uh, the action we're planning today at 2 o'clock uh, against uh, Lord Mayor Robert Doyle, who is for some reason part of uh, this white ribbon dealio, domestic violence. Uh, Yes, so apparently he's a good spokesman. He should be involved in anything to do with defending women against domestic violence, even though he is the Lord Mayor who called the cops on a whole lot of young women uh, on the 21st of October and had them roundly thrashed by the police. A bit of cognitive dissonance there. Moving our stuff. Stuff moving. We seem to do this every single day. <laughs> We're all getting uh, fit, except for those of us who uh, are getting fit and also smoking a lot of cigarettes, like I am. They've got about a third of a lung left. That can't be good. This movement's going to give me lung cancer. <laughs> Yay! All right, we've just been given the heads up. Cops are on their way with council workers, so I've got a plan to. Uh, move things around when they get here. Wait for the call mate. Alright. It's all good. Alright, here they come for another exciting, exciting episode. Yeah, I think we need one more person here. It's just a bit heavy. Uh, no thought to spring to mind. I think I'll add some narration later on. At the very least, they're um, just cops. They're not riot cops, so that's a good sign for now. Now we're recording. So what we're doing is a little thing called running away with our stuff. Let's see how it works. I'm interested to see if they come after us. They're certainly walking towards us. We're on the footpath. So we should be oh, officially out of the park, out of the ballpark. Uh, Interesting. Way up there we've got the Fifi trucks to come and steal our gear for, I don't know, the 50th time in a row. <laughs> this is uh, people protesting for free speech, human rights, civil rights, actual democracy. And yes, the problem is, the powers that be know that what we're doing is working. It's global, it's all around the world, it can't be stopped. So because it can't be stopped, they've got to try and stop it. If you can follow the fucking logic there, mate. Alright, I've been let out of Melbourne Custody Centre. The magistrate told the cops, no, I should have the right to be in a park to have a picnic or protest or demonstrate or whatever. And now critical mass are here. Showing their support, and we're showing our support to them too. So, fucking fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>